time you want to start. Okay. Hello, everyone. Thank you for coming out. I really appreciate you taking the time out of your day to come serve us by helping us become better leaders and speakers. I'm just going to give you a little bit of background about myself. My name is Leah Chance. I'm a senior here at Oak Ridge High School. I'm on the varsity team for both cross country and for track. And I have over a thousand volunteer hours at different places like the Children's Museum, different churches and fairs. Now I have a question for you. Did you know that our words have the power to either break down people or break down barriers? Connections with people are what make our world go around. Even if it's only for a couple of seconds, that's still enough time to create or to destroy something. In the 30 seconds that I used to greet you and thank you for your service, I invested some positive into you. I showed you my gratitude for your service, which helped you feel appreciated. But I also, most importantly, made a connection with you. That connection is the foundation for future connections, for future friendships, and for future mentorships. You know, connections give people leverage for some influence. For example, if we were all on a track team and you were running a 400 meter, which is typically one lap around a four lap track, like the one here at Oak Ridge High School or over at Robertsville Middle School, and you just did awful, you did really badly. And you came up to me after it was done and I was like, you did so great, that was awesome, do that every single time. But you know that you did bad. Now you feel bad, and you distrust me because I've broken that connection because I didn't speak the truth. It was not beneficial to me what I said. It was not beneficial to you what I said to you. It's not going to help you learn how to run a 400 meter better. It's not beneficial to me because now I don't have anybody to compete with. And it's not beneficial for our team because now we're not going to win the meet. However, if I offer you some truth and promote some things that you did well during your 400 meter, if I instead said, hey, you know what? That wasn't your best 400 meter. But 80 seconds is not that bad. It's faster than other people's. You did a really good job of popping your shins at the end, fixing your posture, and passing people. However, we need to work on your focus during the middle because that's where you start to slow down. I made a comment that produces well. It benefits you because now you know how to fix your 400 meter runner and run it better. It benefits me because now I have somebody to compete with. And it benefits our whole track team because we have two front end runners in the 400 meter dash. It's fair to you because it's the truth. And it leaves you with a feeling of friendship and goodwill. Now that we have this connection and your track times are better, I have influence. I've just served you by promoting what you did well and by pointing out some things that you need to work on. What if I did that for every single person on our track team? You know, I may not be a team captain or anything on this team, but I am still a leader because I have made the connections and I had the credibility, so now I have the influence. We are now a unit that serves well for its function of becoming the best athletes that we can possibly be. creating a positive environment for each other to flourish in by making sure that we spoke the truth, that we spoke goodwill, so that we had a fair environment and that it benefited everyone. You know? The glue to any group of people is the connections that we have with them. The administrator of that glue is the leader who chooses to use this rotary test to apply this rotary test to the decisions that they make with and for their group. At the beginning of my speech, I stated that our words have the power to either break down people or break down barriers. Well, I choose for my words to break down barriers by speaking the truth, creating a fair environment so that connections will grow into friendship and goodwill, creating a beneficial environment. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you for coming. Sorry. Okay, that's fine. That's good. And it was uh, four minutes and 50 seconds, I think. So. Okay. So, good, good. Well, uh, I'm glad you 
we had that second chance because you did a very good job in that. So. You did awesome.